We are currently living in a free market country. People are free to buy or sell. The mechanism of our market is made in such a way that sellers must compete against each other by offering cheaper goods or higher quality ones. Now what would happen if all of a seller's competitors disappeared? Imagine if different sellers in an industry banded together to form just one company. Or if one company bought all of its competitors' companies. Or if there is only one company present in an entire industry. For sure, that company would dominate the market. They could easily control the market of their industry, increase its prices, decrease the quality of its products or services, and eventually increase its profit margins by far. All for the owner's gain. To prevent this from happening, the Philippine Competition Act was passed. This created the Philippine Competition Commission. The Philippine Competition Commission is the government agency tasked to implement this act by preventing companies from explicitly colluding with each other to control the market. In order to compete, a company would look for cheaper alternatives in its production of goods or services and innovate to get a bigger market share demand, thus ensuring an efficient and effective market in the Philippines. But how is this relevant to the common Filipino, especially those experiencing poverty? As of now, there are hundreds of companies from different industries in the Philippines. Any of them, especially the biggest companies, could change the course of our economy. But all of them are responsible for our jobs, our salaries, our livelihood, and essentially, how our future will be in this country. For the rich, this may not be a big deal, but for those in poverty, for those who find it hard to buy basic needs, this could be very helpful. This competition act would result in a lower cost of living because of cheaper food, petroleum products, electricity and water bills, and so on, which means that getting through the week, eating three meals a day, having enough water and meeting all the other basic needs would be easier. This will serve as a huge helping hand for the common Filipino and will ensure that for the things we buy in the market, we will surely purchase for the rightful amount.